Hey guys, are you ready? Cause I'm ready. <laughs> Here I am in the hotel and I'm getting ready to go downstairs and go to the hospital uh, here at Memorial Herman and have my brain cut open. Said my prayers, gathered my thoughts. I've uh, been reading all of your texts, um, comments on all the socials. It's been very uplifting, so thank you. I feel like I'm, I'm ready now. I got my Make Every Cast Count shirt on. I got my fishing free cat. I'm wearing my most comfy boots. Just keeping it real down here. But the biggest comfort mechanism I got is Ocean Spoon Girl and you guys. Um, she's downstairs getting all my other stuff ready. She's gonna be doing some a little bit of filming uh, of this situation for you guys. And then we're gonna go through with the dang thing. And uh, I just wanted to kinda get my last moments on camera before my brain changes a little bit. And I wanted to get my sweet hairdo. To get my last moments with, with my hair fully uh, fully engaged uh, before they before they shave it up and I look all strange so <laughs> here we go <sighs> I'm a little nervous but it's time to stand up now with pride I'm gonna walk into that hospital and we're gonna do this dang thing fishing freaks here we go Floor 12 Going down. Lobby. Just figured out that uh, the Astros won last night, so that's how much I watch sports. <laughs> so uh, big shout out to the city of Houston. I feel like I feel like this is destiny that I'm here on the victory day getting my brain surgery done in the heart of H-Town. So, big shout out to you guys. I'm starting to get nervous. I'm like, I'm clammy. You're clammy? I'm clammy. My hands are clammy. Pass the camera off to Ocean Swing Girl. Let her take over. Okay, honey. I'm passing the camera to you. Okay. You always laugh when you get nervous. I know I do. <laughs> That's how you know I'm nervous. Hey, Ocean Swing Girl. Hey, Ocean Swing Girl. Hey, Is it getting real? I, I, yeah, it's getting real. I gotta put this on. I gotta put these long pantyhose type sock <laughs> things on. Um, these yellow socks. This, uh, what they call this party hat. Your party hat. A party hat. I gotta get, uh, I gotta get totally fucking naked right here. And, uh, I'm gonna put this gown on. This is gonna be my attire for the next, well, for the weekend, basically. And you have to do one more shower. I have to do one more shower? Yeah. Are you serious? So let's get started. Go so get naked. I have to get naked? Get naked. Okay. Boy. It's, it's just not the same when you're in a hospital. <laughs> I feel like I'm about to get in the nutcracker. <laughs> Yeah, I read that. You okay. do the fishing and YouTubing yes. and all that stuff. Yeah. Yes. My good brain, so you can. Let me pop up real quick. We're all plugged in here. Got the IV, got all my, my tags. Then put LFG on there. Just a straight up name. They don't know you as LFG. Rock star. Jeez. <laughs> Everyone's been really cool at this hospital. We've all been down with uh, the YouTube thing. Um, 
so it's been really nice. They got got me taken care of with this Space Age unit. Here. Yeah, what is that Space blanket? Age pool noodle thing. I don't, I don't know. It's really nice though. It's, it's like a warming. Warm. Yes. <sighs> so we're about to go in. It's about to it's about to happen. Thank you guys for everything leading up to this point. All of your uh, comments, prayers, support. I know I say that all the time. It seems like every video now, but um, it was truly nice to be able to just read things all the way up until like we'll be in here and be fine, guys. Are you still having some headaches or any pain in any of your body? Yeah. I got so many so many things going through me right now I can't feel too much, but my head hurts a lot. I know it's late since it's hurt for a long time. So Willis is officially out. How do you feel? I feel great. Willis is out. From what I hear so far. Things went really well. My head hurts like crazy. It's late at night. Surgery took longer than expected. Yeah, you were in there all day long. You finally got back around 8 o'clock. They wouldn't even let us see you until 8. Yeah. We last said goodbye to you at like 11 this morning. Everything went well. You know, doctor said literally everything went as smoothly as it possibly could have. Willis is completely gone. And look at your face. I mean, you look gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, that's a lie. Check back in the morning, right, babe? Yep. I'm staying all night right there. Not gonna be too far from you. Will she take care of me? All right. And you got your lucky fish pillow? Yeah, my lucky bass. One of the fishy freaks sent this in. And I felt like it was appropriate to take it here to the hospital. I wish I had Winston here by my side. Mm-mm. But this will have to do. <laughs> yeah, it's the best we got for now. Good morning. Good morning, babe. Uh, How are you feeling this morning? I feel like somebody hit me in the head with a sledgehammer. Yeah, you got a pretty gnarly black eye. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Um, I couldn't really sleep because I've had tubes hooked up to me everywhere. I got one on my head, I've got two on my arms. I had one in my crotch. <laughs> it was called a catheter. Um, they, uh, they cut my, my tendon on my jaw so it sort of talked. So, just to give you guys a brief rundown though, um, I'm going to be hanging out here in the ICU. Um, for just a little while longer, and then I'm going to be going over to the regular general admission part of the hospital. It sucked. <laughs> the good news is, though, um... That's the worst part. Yeah, that's the worst part. Everything else went well. I got my bass with me. One of the fishing freaks sent in. Appreciate it. And, uh... We're just gonna chill out. We're gonna take it easy for a while, guys. I'll see you on the I don't flip side. My brain <laughs> no, you're gonna get a pirate patch to wear on your eye. Am I? Yeah. You're gonna be Captain Rack. Captain Rack? Mm hmm. He also said if you wanted to move around the little hallway, I wanna move. You could take your first step. I'm tired of laying here. I bet you are. Your butt must be sore. But sore. I just feel like Frankenstein here. All right. Well, we'll try to get you moving. Okay. So we got some breakfast. You wanted an omelet. Everything on it. A little bread muffin. Healthy Chew would be proud. Uh, and I got coffee. And you got some coffee. Yeah. How's that coffee taste? Delicious. <laughs> like home brewed. Not quite as good as home brewed. It's not bad for hospital breakfast. That omelet looks pretty delicious. Yeah. Made with real eggs. Can't really see it too good. <laughs> I can't really look at both my eyes. But 
It looks awesome. Mm, so this is your first meal that you've had since eaten since you've been here. Over 30 hours. Yeah, because it was hours. It was 7.30 at night the night before your surgery, and it's been a full day. I asked people on Twitter if they would want to eat after brain surgery. Mm-hmm. A lot of them said Whataburger. That's disgusting. Can you believe that? I'm so glad that you went with an omelette. It's a Mondo bite. It might be hot. Oh yeah, they cut a piece of my jaw, my tendon, so I can't open my mouth all the way. Why you get smaller bites? Nope, you're determined, okay. Scale of one to ten, how good is that? If I could chew it all the way, it'd be a ten. <laughs> good though. You're walking. Walking. It's progress. You're looking good. You feel nauseous at all? I feel like something happened like right about here. Oh, I think something did happen right about there. Not so much here, right here, but like right here. <laughs> it looks like you're wearing some makeup. Yeah. We're in black and blue, <laughs> like my jig colors. <laughs> All right, this is your new. We're gonna be bringing your bed. Don't worry. New crib. Your new crib. I know this is like one of the nice. You got a sweet. <laughs> you got a sweet. This is the nicest hospital I've ever been in. These are the Astros fans right here. Getting ready to celebrate in the city of Houston. I've got a little seat right outside of the parade here. Just got up and took my uh, third walk of the day. Wanted to show you guys this eye right here. Take a good look at that. It's the worst black eye I've ever had. They had to go do some extra work in there um, behind the tumor. I'll have to give you guys a better update. Let Ocean Spoon Girl kind of update you when I get back because I'm still in the pretty, uh, pretty weird state right now. Uh, this is going to take a while to go down, but they just did a lot of a lot of work in there. The tumor was bigger than expected and uh, so they had to really dig in there deep. That's why I'm going to have a black eye for a while. So it's a nice it's a nice shiner, I would say. All right, so this is your last supper in the hospital room. What did you get? I got me some teriyaki chicken, some veggies, brown rice. Trying to be proud over there. <laughs> it's a pretty good meal in itself. You got some hot tea, some honey. So. What is in this? I think that's just some lemon. Hopefully you can get some sleep tonight because you have not gotten much sleep at all for the past 24 hours. No. Been kind of miserable, just just kind of loopy. Not a lot of medicine. You're pretty sharp right now, though. Well, thank you. Well, tonight is our last night in the hospital, and while Justin is asleep over here, I've got a nice little bed right next to him. So I kind of made my own little cot. Got a blanket, pillows, not too far from LFG. This room's kind of nice because we've got lots of windows. So. Hopefully tonight we actually get some sleep. You know, last night we barely got any sleep. I probably fell asleep for maybe three hours, but I don't think Justin got anything. So, he's almost down for the night, so. I'm gonna wrap up this and we'll see you tomorrow morning. But I'll put his little staple in, because that hurts less than putting a stitch in. Quite a little old suture that's there, it won't hurt.
when we're all right. So it's gonna come out, okay? I'm gonna let you know before I pull it. One, three, one, two, three. Mm -hmm. One, three, okay. You look as good as new. <laughs> um, it is 6.30, so we just got woken up. Well, actually, Justin's been up pretty much all night. He didn't get too much sleep. One of the doctors just came in, one of the surgeons that was helping with surgery, and kind of took out the tube that Justin had in his head um, and stapled it back up, so he got a staple yeah. at bedside. It's no longer connected to anything. So he's kind of a free man right now. Um, when you got two IVs left, and he's basically just got his um, bandage right now, and he's discharged. So we are probably gonna head out of here in a couple hours. So let's. We're just watching Major League Fishing. I can has got one on. Yep. What do you know? Fishing in the hospital. I think I want to take a shower here, kind of get cleaned up, and then make the trek. Let's trek back. Start right. this journey. Are you ready to go? No, I'm good. I'm ready. Good. Okay. Yes. Got my fish. Got my shiner bar. <laughs> you wish. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so proud of that fish. <laughs> you can cross the double doors. <laughs> you're, almost, you're almost there. Now that you've accomplished brain surgery, what are you going to do next? Get a big old bath. Step it in the face. One that big? All right, get all comfy. Uh, uh, Put on yeah. some Stranger Things for you. Yeah. All right, guys, so we finally made it back home. Um, this is kind of where we're gonna leave Justin. He hasn't really gotten much sleep in the last, what, 48 hours. There'll be more videos coming in the next couple days, so make sure to be checking that out. We'll subscribe um, right here. Um, thanks for all the support, love. If you just uh, want to keep commenting and you know showing your support by either subscribing or there's going to be merchandise links down at the bottom, go check that out as well. And all the good life, guys. Love you guys. See you later.